Hello everybody, it's Joe the Locksmith, sitting in a 2015 Audi A8, and we just want to determine if the BCM2 can be able to be read to the OBD, or if it's encrypted and needs to be removed and read on the bench. Generally 13 and up, you have to do on the bench, OBD is not supported, but we're just going to double check. So right now we're plugged in through the OBD, we're going to go to Emo, accept. We're going to choose Audi. Do a manual selection. A8. 10 to 17. Okay. Let's just go to control unit. It's the BCM2 immobilizer. Okay. What we're going to do is we're going to do read emo data via programmer, encrypted. Okay, we just can choose the first one if we don't know. We're just going to say OK. And we want to do step one, identify the vehicle information. We're just going to put the hazards on, keep the car awake. Okay, we'll just click save. Okay, so here's our VIN number. And we're looking for this ECU software version number here. 0551. So that means it's an encrypted version. I have a list of the encrypted versions on our VIP membership. So you can check there. So this is telling us that we do have to remove the BCM and read it on the bench. You cannot read it through the OBD. All right, that's just a quick tip for you. Once again, it's a 2015 Audi A8. This is how you determine the BCM software version, whether it is encrypted or not, whether it has to be read on the bench or through the OBD. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.